Hi guys, it's Monica. Thank you so much for joining me. I am going to share an update on a couple of devices I've been using and some new skincare, at least new to me in the last month that I've been using and some empties. So if you're curious, what I've been using on my 69-year-old skin that even a doctor who recently saw me in real life without any lights, with everyday makeup, was amazed at. And this is a oncologist, and the oncologist was amazed. So if you're curious, stay tuned. <laughs> How's that for a tease? <laughs> I know that was a big tease, you know, but it's the truth. You know, I've had a number of medical issues the last couple of years. And when I first went back to my primary, who hadn't seen me for a year, then about two years ago, he made a comment as well. But in general, when I went to the dermatologist, when I went and had my Mohs surgery, when I went to, for my ear, I went to, I've gone to a number of doctors that in the last two years, these are people that really don't know me. So they've commented on my skin and they see me, not the way you see me, right? I mean, they, they I don't have lights. I don't have a bunch of, I don't have a bunch of makeup on now anyways. But I don't, you know, just wear very little makeup in my day-to-day -day work world. And, um, and even the oncologist this last time, she came in and she said, you don't look 69. And that's the type of comments I get from healthcare providers, from the nurse practitioner who saw me two months ago, said, I can't believe you are 69. When we watched you walk by the nurse's station to go into the examining room, we thought we, there was the wrong person coming in because we were looking for someone that was a 69 year old woman and we didn't think that was you. And I'm not exaggerating, I'm not saying that to make myself feel good or whatever. It's just the comments that I get. And I know I'm far from perfect and my skin is far from perfect, but I, I know that the things that I have been using on my skin and my consistency has really made a difference and because it's made such a huge difference for me, it inspires me to continue on, obviously. So one of the things that I want to tell you that I have been using for a month now, and I started to use this. This is something that Babs Take Control of Beauty. She has talked about Ella Frida for the longest, longest time. It is a U.S. company. I believe they're based in Florida. They ship to Canada, to the U.K. They ship pretty much to a lot of the larger countries and they have a really lovely lovely product line and I was fortunate enough to have Simon from Ella Frida actually reach out to me and offer to send me a couple of products that I could try and because I know that Babs loves their products I was like all over it I was like oh yes I will definitely try it so I mentioned this before, they sent me a cleanser. This cleanser is really, really nice. It has a very, it just, it just gives your, it almost polishes your skin in a way. And it's not, I don't believe any exfoliation uh, or anything of that nature, but it, it just gently kind of polishes your skin. It leaves it that clean. It smells really nice. It goes on really smooth. And more importantly, your skin feels super nice afterwards. Sometimes when you use something on your skin, sometimes it can leave it dry feeling at the end. This feels really, really nice. Then they also have a toner, a hydrating toner that I've used. And this along with, which came in perfectly for me because I use the Ordinary Glycolic Toner a lot. And I have one other toner that I really like, a seaweed type of a toner. So I don't like to use a glycolic toner every day or the seaweed toner every day. So this was just a really nice treat. I really like it. Again, this is something that goes on really nice. When I do my morning skincare, right, and I use my toner, the products that I use in the morning have to play nice with my makeup. 
and if I was just going to use something at night, I probably wouldn't care, right? Because I'm not going to put makeup on. But so when I put the toner on and I and I let it dry on, and you know I might do the rest of my skincare, and you know I might end up doing my last thing is usually my um, my sunscreen. So I want the combination of everything that I put on to work well together. And so far, this has really, really worked well together. They have this really nice, gentle exfoliator. I really like this. Now, their products are, they're, they're, it, maybe if you want to call it price range, higher drugstore, $20, $30 range, right? So mid, mid to lower range or whatever. Um, you know, I look at some creams that are $60, $70 or exfoliation, and to me that's just like crazy. But the price point on these are very, very good. And I have a 25% off coupon, which if you're interested in, you know, pursuing the products, the link will be below. I really like this. And you know what, Babs, if you know Babs from Take Control of Beauty, she has raved about this. And, and I know that, you know, I pray for Babs every day. I know, I know those of you that follow her, uh, pray for her as well. She has just the most amazing skin. She's, she's a woman in her 80s and you would never, never know it by looking at some of her videos. I pray that she gets healthy. She's going through breast cancer and, and many of you know that. But anyways, looking at Babs has been an inspiration for skincare for this product and also to make sure that I'm very, very proactive with manograms, with, you know, taking care of my body. That, um, that is a lesson that is really being hammered home by, home by everything that Babs is going through. So I said I wasn't going to try the vitamin C because I have a big bottle of vitamin C. And I really hate to have too many open products, but if this is a pump, so it's really nice. I love when you have a vitamin C in a pump. Timeless is in a pump now. A few of my other products are in a pump. It makes it so that you're preserving it, you're not contaminating it. It just, I think the pump system, especially for vitamin Cs, really is awesome. And they have a pump system for almost, so far, everything other than the toner and they actually do have a, a pump that you can put in there and of course the, the exfoliating cream. So these are the four products that were sent to me. I've been using them for a month. I like them a lot. I like them a real lot. And they're, and my the vitamin C is too new because I just started to use it. But the last two times I've used it, I haven't had any issues. Vitamin C is what I have the hardest time with my makeup afterwards because it, it sometimes just pills up and is really awful. So the vitamin C, the product line, I think is just really, really awesome. Granted, it's only been a month, but I am loving it. And I think, especially with the 25% off that I have, I just think that's an amazing discount and the price point comes way, way down. So thank you to Ella Frida, sent to me complimentary. In exchange for review, they didn't have any stipulations. They wanted me to try it. Obviously, if I like it, talk about it. Um, they didn't say, if you don't like it, don't talk about it. But that's sort of like the, you know, the uh, unsaid words. If you hate our products, don't mention them. So I really like their products a lot. I really do. I think that they've got a great line. The other thing that, and, then, and many of you have asked about this. I have talked about my Candy Way. I will link that below. I have talked about the mask that I use, my Candy Way. I have put it. I'm, I have put it on my scar um, in the morning. I, I'm very, very lazy when it comes to that. I get up. I mentioned this before. I might wipe my face. Sometimes I, I just refresh with a, a makeup wipe, but many times just a face cloth. Just refresh it. Go back to bed. I let it. It dries. I put on my Candy Way mask and I just lie there. Ten minutes, five days a week is what I'm doing. 10 minutes, five days a week. And I do it Monday through Friday, so it's very easy for me to remember Saturday and Sunday, no candy way. And I put it on my breast for my lumpectomy scar, which was quite big on the, on the top. I absolutely love, love. I think that has made the biggest difference in my most recent skincare. I've been using it since April. I think my skin has thickened up. I think the texture of my skin is better, and I'm really thinking that it has given me 
moisture back in my skin instead of it being as dry as it was. So the other thing that I'm using is, is Current Body. The Current Body, I'm going to open this up. I want to make sure. Yeah, Current Body. The Current Body, I don't have a discount code. They often have sales. They have different combinations. But I use the hand. And my hands are pretty bad. My hands are pretty bad. I have some age spots. I have wrinkles. My mother has in the past talked about how old my hands look. I have been using this and I have been using it on the same schedule Monday through Friday. I'm going to probably increase it. I don't think it'll hurt. But I've been using it. it. You plug it in. You have clean hands. You need to make sure your hands are clean. You don't have any sunblock. You don't have any makeup. You don't have anything. On. So I always wash my hands. Dry my hands. Plug it in. Put it on. Sometimes I put it on my lap. It's a stable surf surface. And I turn it on and it goes for 10 minutes. And I'm just like listening to a podcast or I have the news going and I just kind of veg out while my hand is in that machine. When I'm done, when it's done, I unplug it and then you can put a moisturizer. So what I've been doing, and I get this off of um, Amazon, you can probably get it anywhere, but I really, really like this. I've been using this on my legs. Um, you know, it's supposed to help with crepey skin. Um, it's got fr uh, ferulic acid, retinol. Um, it says it's an anti-sagging. <laughs> so, but this is what I've been using. So afterwards, after I do it, then I moisturize my hands. You can moisturize your hands with anything. This is pretty affordable. I have it on auto delivery on Amazon. When I find something that I buy on Amazon that I like, I usually do auto delivery. So I have it on auto delivery. So then I put that on and I let it, you know, let it dry. And, and I, I, I hate to say it because it's been a short period of time. It's been a month, but I, I, I'm seeing a difference in my hands. <laughs> I don't know if anyone else can, but, and I know it's too soon, but I'm seeing a difference. I feel that my skin just like my face is starting to thicken up a little. Is it wishful thinking? I don't know. I don't know. It's probably too soon to really know, but that's what I'm thinking. So, you know, I really, I think I probably am going to cut this video short at this point because I was going to go into my empties, but I think then the video will be way too long. And, you know, based on my demographics, I think probably you know, after seven or eight minutes, unless you're super interested in the topic, you're gonna, you're gonna phase off. But I really think that it's made, made a difference. And again, that was sent to me, complimentary. I, I'll link the website and I'm just putting this cream on. I like this cream. The cream was not sent to me. It, it's the current body device for the hands. And I just really, I think it makes a difference. If my hands continue to improve, I'm going to be dancing a jig and you guys will all know about it because it's 69. I was thrilled when my face started to look better. I never thought my hands would look better, but my gosh, I think they are looking better. You know, I do. And it's like, you know, and I don't do much with my hands, right? Because I, I, I don't have a dishwasher, so I am the dishwasher. I don't tend to go and have manicures and pedicure, pedicures on a regular basis, and I don't have fake nails um, on. I can't tell you when the last time I had nails done. It's probably, I don't know, probably last, I don't know, <sighs> maybe last summer sometime. It's been, it's been a while. I do like to have a pedicure, and I'll probably go have one of those done soon. But this has been working really well, you know, and I put it, like I said, on my, my hands as well, my legs as well. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to stop the video here and these two products as an update because I did want to let you know because people ask all the time. And, um, and I think the combination of my collagen, because I do take that collagen powder every day, but because, because I'm super consistent, if I was a person that took collagen for 30 days and then stopped, but I've been taking it for years. So I'm super, super consistent when I believe something works. And my collagen supplement, 
the powder, I noticed something very quickly into it because I used to have dry, crakey elbows that bled. That's how dry my skin was. When I started to use my collagen powder, that was the first thing I noticed. That I said, wow, something's funky about my elbows. They're not dry, they're not, they're not bleeding. So when I saw that difference way back in 2016, I said, I'm gonna keep using this stuff, and I did. So I think that taking the, because it's internal, you drink it, it's not something tropical, you don't put it on, um, but I think that has made a huge difference. And of course, at the same time, I started my Retin-A, so I, I use Retin-A, um, but I'm at the point where with, with my Retin-A, I use the 1%, I probably use it three times a week, you know? I'm not as like, I'm not a, a daily user, I think my skin is acclimated and I think it's helping it. I would certainly benefit from more tightening. I've been using some devices. Um, the one that I've been using is a uh, Fubushi. I think I showed that in my last video. So I've been doing that every day just to try to tighten here where my jowls are. I don't know if it's going to work. But anyways, I'm going to stop talking. I'm going to end this video because it'll be super, super long. And I will. you'll probably see me in my next video in the same outfit because I'm going to just record my empties right after this. So thank you so much for watching. And if you're new to my channel, please subscribe. Thank you.